chat gpt passes google coding interview for level 3 engineer this was in the news recently and this was really interesting to me and this was chat gpt 3 now we have chat gpt 4 which is way smarter and way more complex and it can solve a lot of exams that's all the exams it can solve including lead code easy medium and hard they published this in their research paper just to flex i think except upsc even ai can't solve that so i wanted to try if chat gpt can actually solve google coding interview questions which is one of the toughest interviews in tech and apparently only 0.2 percent of the candidates make it so is ai really as smart as a google engineer no way okay so first i need to figure out all the questions that google has actually asked in their interviews and this is really confidential like they make you sign an agreement which says you can't talk about this let's see if chat gpt can come up with the questions too but 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 we'll use chat gpt 4 instead of chat gpt 3 chat gpt 3 was the older one and chat gpt 4 is the cooler kid in the block right now but there was a problem i didn't know where or how to use chat gpt 4 so i started searching so it turns out that chat gpt is only accessible via Bing AI that you need to be invited to use or via ChatGPT Plus which is a paid subscription of $20 so am i about to spend my entire life savings to get access to ChatGPT Plus maybe mama so i got the card yeah there goes my life savings This was expensive. You better subscribe to my channel. Now I have access to ChatGPT 4, which is supposed to be much better than ChatGPT 3, and it was released like last week. Let's try this. 25 messages every 3 hours. That is going to be really, really low. So ChatGPT 4 has a lot more reasoning and conciseness as compared to the previous models. Now that I have access to ChatGPT 4, I can use this to generate the questions as well because the questions that are asked in Google interview are really confidential. So it's really hard to like get those questions to even practice. You can go on lead code discuss section and check the interview experience and search Google here to actually get the questions that are asked in these interviews. Obviously I can do that but I have access to the smartest AI system right now. So let's just ask ChatGPT to generate the questions as well. So it has actually generated a few questions, some coding questions, some system design questions and some behavioral questions as well. And these are not really that bad. Like this is something similar to what you can expect in actual interviews. Wait, no. I don't think any company is going to ask how to reverse a singly linked list. That is way too difficult for an interview. Now that I have a few questions, the next step was to interview ChatGPT with these questions. So at the end of the video, I'll judge if ChatGPT actually passed this interview or not. So now it's time to actually interview ChatGPT with these questions. So So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick two technical one system design and one behavioral question and see how it fares So there's this interesting thing about ChatGPT is that I can tell it to act a certain way This should actually like listen to me and behave like that So I have given it a prompt that you are a candidate being interviewed for an L3 software engineer role at Google I'm your interviewer I'll ask you two programming one system design question and one behavioral question and you will respond to that as someone being interviewed if you make a mistake i will give you hints to correct you this is like how an interview usually is obviously they don't ask you programming and system design and behavioral questions in the same interview but uh, we don't have a time limit here <laughs> so let's see how it does i'll give it a question uh, given a string find the length of the longest substring without repeating characters which is a really good question i'll ask it to write a code in c++ and then i waited for it to do its magic and write the code okay i'll pretend to be a candidate and provide my responses to the question that's nice okay so it is going with the map approach it has given me the solution function and the main function as well uh let me try to actually compile it <laughs> it actually works now i know that chat gpt is trained on a lot of web pages which might contain this question as well and this is scraped from some website so i want to see if it is actually able to change the code based on my recommendation can you change the main function to accept a string input well this is the ultimate test can ai take input from me and actually work on it and as i waited for chat gpt to come up with a solution i remembered how close i am to hitting 100000 subscribers i know we can do it so go ahead and click on that subscribe button right now and let's get okay. back okay well that's me losing it, <laughs> it is actually changed that part of the code and asked for an input for the string because an ai just took commands from me understood me and made changes according to what i had to say that's really scary there goes my job security let's input a string should be 3 yeah Cool. Let me try another question here. I want this to generate medium to hard DP or graph questions. So usually in some interviews it goes till graph or DP, and that's a pretty realistic scenario. And I'll ask it to suggest questions that are asked in L4 software engineering interviews rather than L3 because L4 has a higher bar, and the questions should be a lot more difficult. So it generated some questions, but these are not really that difficult. So I'll ask it to generate more difficult questions. Can you generate harder 
question so there's this question that i really like that given a 2d grid representing a city find the shortest route for a delivery truck to visit a specified list of locations while minimizing the total distance traveled i know this question can be asked in an interview it is a little complicated to code so i've given a prompt that you are being interviewed for an l3 software engineering role at google and here is your question and then i have pasted the question and i've asked it to write a code in c++ yep this is a traveling salesman problem it has given me a solution with held carp algorithm i had no idea uh, about this algorithm and it has given me a complexity and told me that it might not be efficient for a large number of locations and it is using dp with bit masks moving on <laughs> let me ask chat gpt to solve a system design question let's see what it comes up with so i have given it a prompt that you need to design a system to handle millions of users uploading and downloading files concurrently which is a pretty common question because a lot of apps actually use this no way no way <laughs> it has actually given me a response with load balancers application servers file chunking data deduplication distributed storage content delivery networks i mean this is a pretty good answer like for a question like this if you want all these responses and you don't want to sign up for chat gpt plus i'll put all of these solutions down in the comment section okay now the most interesting part so you know chat gpt is an ai bot right there's no experiences that it has actually have had so like I'll ask it for some behavioral questions and let's see like if it can come up with something does it make it up like how does it do okay <laughs> so I've given it a prompt here's your last question describe a situation where you had to deal with a difficult team member how did you handle it now this is an AI bot it shouldn't have to deal with difficult team members so is it going to act like a human or will it make something up let's see let's see what it comes up with yep yep <laughs> That's a pretty smart answer. So it gives me a hypothetical scenario. This is amazing. And I'm actually blown away by like how smart this is. So was ChatGPT able to pass this interview? I think that's a pretty easy yes. Yeah, it is really smart. There's no such thing as job security. You should probably buckle up and increase your skills. Watch this video right here. Bye-bye.